look at this. This is the shea butter cream. It's nice and thick. It's not too hard. It's perfect consistency. See how it comes up? In. It's nice and thick. This is perfect. So this is exactly what I wanted. Okay, so I use uh, my daily routine to pamper my skin, and it's very good and healthy. Okay, so if you want to see how I make this nice creamy shea butter, just watch this video and get the information. Alright, enjoy. Hi guys, good evening. So, as part of my self-care series, I'm going to make shea butter cream. So, I've had purchased shea butter and if you've, if you've ever worked with raw shea butter it's a bit hard so like, it's very hard to get it out of the tub so i'm gonna make it so that it's soft and creamy and easy to be applied to the skin so i'm going to use half of this amount right now it's 16 ounces so i'll use eight ounces so half of that amount I'll mix it with maybe four ounces of of coconut oil okay and i'm just gonna add a bit of mineral oil to it and then add my oil so tea tree oil some vitamin e and some peppermint and i think i might have some yeah i think that's it so i'm gonna melt the shea butter i have the Hot on the stove right now so I'm gonna add that there with the coconut oil and when those are melted I'm gonna add my oils and then I'm going to show you how I whip it and make my cream okay okay so I have done the eight eight ounces of the shea butter in a bowl so this is the solid Form, hard solid form of shea butter and I did about one cup of the coconut um, oil the solid form and I'm just gonna put those to melt in the pot here and that's the first step they are just slowly melting so I didn't do the direct eat I put it in a little pot of water and then i put the basin in that metal basin in the the pot of water and then they will just melt slowly i think this way it doesn't burn we don't want it to burn okay so it just melts slowly all right and liquid liquidified and I'm just gonna add my oil to it now and then allow it to cool and then I'll stir it until it becomes solidified and creamy. So I'll show you that step. So I've made a little ice bath for it to kind of cool it down and get the process going so that it will start solidifying again and then I will whip it. Okay, so it's just getting nice and set right now, like a solid form, not so liquid anymore. So I'm just gonna use the my whisk mixer to kind of get it nice and fluffy. Okay. Okay, guys. So it's all set. I put it in my little container already. So you see it has a more creamier consistency versus how we started out uh, let me show you that the difference originally it was like really hard very hard to to apply now i have it nice and creamy yes see so it's easy to apply now it is a nice fluffy creamy consistency so 
so now I'll just whip it a bit more and get it more fluffy and it's easy to apply now so that's my shea butter cream and I use this on all over my body and it's great for like dark spots if I have any dark spots I just apply it on there and it helps to improve my skin tone so I love this so this is my shea butter do it yourself so you can always buy the bulk one and get it nice and creamy like that one okay thank you for watching guys